So in this video, this guy's talking about him wanting a relationship and feeling like he's not attractive to the opposite sex. Let's get it. Trust me, like, it's been tough. Really My don't know it's so nuts. Come from a kid that wanted to end it, feeling low, at so young, having these thoughts quite sick and intense. What's going on guys, it's your boy, Ricky Ricardo, who's just that guy for anything, weight loss, weight gain and wellness related from Unrestricted. Boom. I'm gonna review this video and it's just a snippet of a long video by a guy called Kevin Samuels and if you haven't heard of Kevin Samuels he is an image and life coach he talks to women and talks to men about how they can change their image and step their life game up but there's this one clip I want to go over and review the only reason why is because I want your opinion you're 38 yeah just turned kind of shape are you in. um I, I'm overweight, I'm working on but it right now. Okay, okay, you got two struggles already. You can't be short and fat. Now, Kevin Samuels, he's alluding to the fact that he is short and fat, so he's got two struggles, which is going to get in the way of him finding a potential partner. Is that right? Is that correct? Is him being short and fat affecting him progressing and finding a relationship. Now, anybody watching, do you hold the criteria of being short and overweight, but you successfully are in a long-term functioning, functional relationship? Is it possible for you to be short and overweight and date and court and find yourself into relationships? I just wanna know. Yeah. Two strikes, you gotta pick a struggle. That's true. Cooper slides five foot five, but he's yoked. You know that. Why are you short and fat? You can't really control your height, all right? But there's many different reasons why someone will put on weight, be overweight, be obese. I'm not trying to give excuses for anyone, but I'm just saying there's many different reasons why someone will be overweight, obese. They can't find a partner to get into the relationship with. They're sad, they're low. So they use food as a pick-me-up, which leads to weight gain, which kind of adds to the potential problem that Kevin Samuels is alluding to, but there's many different reasons why people are overweight. So for him to ask him why are you short and why are you overweight, <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's a hard question. Why? You know women don't, I mean, you, why? Um, I just you're not, rich. you're not rich. You can't be short and fat. Now, my question is, if you fit in the criteria of being short and overweight, but you're in a relationship, is that because you are financially stable? Let me know. Because Kevin Samuels is alluding to the fact that you can be short and overweight, but if you got money, it doesn't matter. Is that true? Yeah. How much, uh, about how much do you make a year? Um, 40,000. And how old are you? Well, almost 40. So you're under, so 40 years. So you, so you underemployed too. Yeah. All right, bro. So you, so short, I don't have to worry about that, but your weight and your money fuck with your confidence. Do you feel that if you're overweight, short, and you're not really financially stable, are you less appealing to the opposite sex? Do you not have nothing to bring to the table? Should you just give up on dating? Until you fix these things, should you actually give up? What's your thoughts? What do you think? Let me just, let me just get right, let me get right down to it. In nature, you would be the kind of male that would not need to have, you would not need, why would, why would the female of the species want to take your genes and put them into the next generation? What Kevin Samuels is alluding to, again, is if you are short, overweight, and you're not financially secure, you are not valuable or attractive to the opposite sex. So you are going to struggle with finding a potential partner or mate. Now, is this true? Am I, am I understanding this right? And how many of you guys think that this is correct? This is true, this is factual. People actually think and feel like this. They will not go for anyone that fits in the criteria that Kevin Samuels is deeming unattractive and not valuable. Is this what 2021 has to offer? Is this what we're going through in 2021? Is this how dating is in 2021? Correct. Sure. I mean, you're fat, underemployed, and, and unambitious. Should should males like that in the in the animal world be able to mate? The question is, is that is there someone out there for everyone? You know, of every level, every status, every size, every shape, every trait. Is there someone out there for everyone? Is there?
We are animals. Males like that don't get access to the, the females, man. I don't agree and I don't disagree. But the one thing that he said that was true, and I can speak for myself when I was in the same situation, when I was morbidly obese, me being overweight and not financially secure definitely messed with my confidence. So when I was growing up, I was morbidly obese, right? But what I found out later on is that females was actually attracted to me. Yeah, they was actually attracted to me. But because I didn't have confidence, that was the turn off. That's the reason why, because I didn't have confidence. I really truly believe that there is someone out there for everyone, every shape and size. But you have to have the confidence to approach, to attack, to progress, to pursue, to do whatever it takes for you to win the attention. You have to have confidence. Being short, being overweight, not financially secure, to me, isn't the be all and end all to a successful or unsuccessful dating plan. The lack of confidence is the biggest downfall because you know, I've seen people of every walks of life achieve a successful relationship and most of the time it just comes down to confidence. For me, if you ain't got confidence, that's the biggest downfall, but the rest, you can work around it. I truly believe. And I'm just that guy for anything, weight loss, weight gain and wellness related from Unrestricted. Boom, here's another video for you to watch. And leave a comment down below and let me know if my videos have ever helped you. Having these sports quite sick and in dimension, nearly broke, but rose up. Durable to the shot like suspension. Let me insert like a tendon. But first, can I get your attention? Show my hands in this place for attendance.